guys welcome to insane science so we are here with a new video i know it's a little bit late because we are we were working on a new project and but this one is a little bit different because we are not showing you something how to make but we are introducing our new product this is an sanitizer dispenser and uh, the speciality of this dispenser is that we are not using any uh, sensors that are available in the market we just made our own sensor this is the one uh, that we made uh, and the speciality of this one is it's completely efficient like it's program based sensor uh, and it won't be like there won't be any false triggers uh, because of some elements like sunlight anything else it's completely based uh, on program so it's very effective and uh, i'll show you uh, you can see you can see the sanitizer coming up uh, so this is our new product and it's available in uh, different colors uh, as you like uh, and uh, we are taking in bulk orders so I hope you guys like this and uh, like this product and also I'll show uh, you in the video that while using these ordinary sensors there are many issues that we faced in the beginning. So we just made this new sensor and we will show the difference between both of them. Okay. Thank you. Okay guys, uh, so now you can see both the sensors here and the right one is the sensor that we made and uh, the left one is the available one in the market. Uh, so and I will show you uh, that our sensor is working perfectly and also this one is working perfectly right now because it's not heated by sunlight right now. Huh? If I remove this object from here and the sunlight hits it, it's triggered. That's that's what I call false triggering. So when whenever you keep uh, this kind of products in uh, somewhere the sunlight hits, uh, it will be triggering very falsely so that's the main difference between our sensor and the sensor that's available in the market okay okay uh, guys now it's completely in the sunlight uh, and uh, the ordinary one is triggered on completely uh, but our sensor is not triggered right now but when i move my hand it's triggered you can see it right yeah that's the difference 